What is going on guys? My name is Morgan and welcome back to another episode of The Owl House Season 2. And I'm sorry for my awful appearance right now. I just got out of work. I'm sweaty. I'm filthy. I, I, I'm bleeding. But here we are. <laughs> my shift literally ended at 6am and it's now 6.19. So I, I got my ass home. I turned on my camera. I spilled some soda. I had to clean it up. But now I'm here. And oh boy. And apparent- so- I was on my Discord server and Pat shared this meme of Lou saying like, maybe I'll show you around Connecticut sometime. And apparently Lou's is from Connecticut and I live in fucking Connecticut. Like, oh God, I really hope, I really hope that's true. I'll be so excited. Like, Lou's, where you at? Hit me up. <laughs> I'm still not over last episode. <laughs> oh, I, I get so emotional still just thinking about it. But it did give me... The motivation to continue working on my Lumity comic and I've actually made great progress and if you guys want to see that when it's up um, it'll be up on my Instagram oh I forgot to mention I also have the next two weeks off from work so hopefully next time you guys see me I won't be this pale because <laughs> I'll actually get to spend some some time during the daytime outside instead of you know eight o'clock at night till six in the morning and I'll also be I'm gonna try to be uploading a little bit more uh, this week since- and next week since I actually have the time, so, yeah. Oh boy. Oh no, we're not- we're already in the castle! These are all the coven heads, okay. Oh, they're in front of Bellos! Oh shit! Oh, the Abomatons! Okay, so these are the shots we got during the preview. I- so, okay, so they're in with- they're in with the Emperor, I'm guessing. Oh boy, things just got so interesting and we're probably not even like 30 seconds in. And a glimpse of the reward that awaits. What's the reward? Oh, this is the skull thing! Oh, please don't eat another palace in front of me. Please don't do it. I can't. I can't do this. Oh, Kikamora's mad. Oh, shit. Is he cursed? Oh. oh. What? No, not again. <laughs> oh, my God. Not again. No. The last from our reserves. The palace from wood has been over hard. Uncle, let me help! Because Uncle! Our family is gone because of wild magic. I can't let the same happen to What? You. What are you, dude? Like oh, Kikimura. She be sneaking. Okay, that was all before the intro. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, so either Bellos is cursed, or he's not, like human or a witch he's some type of goop monster what the fuck was that in in the golden guard is bellos's you <laughs> oh my god this is so much to take in and we're not even oh god i'm not ready for this i'm not i feel like i'm on the verge of an emotional break <laughs> okay at least i could bop to this theme song I hope they acknowledge what happened in the last episode with Luz and Amity. Oh! Shit! They changed her hair! Oh my god! I wasn't ready for that! I really wasn't ready for that! Oh my god, okay. Get it together! Now I'm gonna, like, pay attention and make sure I'm not missing anything else. So, like, they're going the she route, where, like, anytime something significant happens, the intro changes. Wait, this- King has both his horns, too! How did I just realize King has both his horns? Hunting talisman. Oh, the Echo Mouse! Oh, he's got a little enclosure! That can get me home. Squeeze it out! <laughs> Won't be getting a magic staff with your classmates. <laughs> she changed like that. Hello? Shouldn't Amity be here? Oh, sorry, Miss. Oh. I heard she stayed home today. Oh. <laughs> uh, actually, 
actually make sense. Good tidings. Oh no! <laughs> oh no, no, no. The angst. Amity's too embarrassed to face Luz and she stayed home. And you know it's bad if she's skipping school. Oh god. Just fucking trample my heart, why don't you? This moment is my case. Oh shit! Oh! What? That was his palace the whole time? Everyone here helps me see. Now, Ooh. traditionally, young witches carve their staffs from the branch of an old palestrum tree. But sadly, palestrum trees are becoming more rare. Yeah, because the Emperor's harvesting them all. Teamed up with Bumpy Poo. Never <laughs> to bring you... That queen! Palisman Adoption Day! Oh! Oh, the little cardinal! Right here. Oh, he's got a little scar! These little ones have not had homes in many years. They want to feel a connection. Want my own palisman, not some trashy hand me down. Basha, shut your mouth. I want to be strong. <gasps> oh, a bee! That's so perfect. I want to play professional grudge bee. <laughs> a competitive spirit. Maya will be thrilled. Maya. Oh, a crab. <laughs> she is crabby. Buy me. Oh, what kind of animal is that? Oh boy. This man born through emotion. I do not sense any conviction from you. That's impossible. What do you hope to accomplish with your magic? Oh, uh, get home to my mom? Would you still train to be a witch in the human realm? Can you even do magic? Oh now? god. Huh, I guess so. Oh, all these okay? uh, realizations. Be a witch like Ida and Azura. I like her pants. I love her outfit. Ah! I've read stories like this. Did I expect to be a witch back in Connecticut? Connecticut! She's from Connecticut! Ah, oh, Lewis, my kin, my kindred spirit! Oh god. I just, of all the of all the places she could have lived, Connecticut, what are the odds? Like, I would have never guessed, like, based on what we've seen of the human realm that she was in Connecticut. Like, yes, Connecticut is very woodsy, but I don't know. I was not getting Connecticut vibes, but I'm so excited. I wouldn't want to be my palace man either. Oh, Luz! <gasps> oh, the Cardinal! It's you. Did you? No, oh. of course not. <laughs> Poor Luz. I'll take you back to your nest. Oh. What if I stay on the Boiling Isles and become a rugged bounty hunter? If I go back to the forest. Oh, wow. She's really thinking on this. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! They're kidnapping the palismans, aren't they? Yep. Oh god, freaking bellows. Why? Oh, loose. Oh. <laughs> Holy shit! Loose. Can you just pull that cord above your head? Oh, thank you. Hi. Whatever. I already broke out there like twice. Then we'll just oh, oh, oh. Say, how did you get back on the ship so fast? Oh. No. Oh shit. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's the hand dragon. Oh god, this creepy ass thing. I still don't like it. Oh, it's got a tongue. Oh. I'm uncomfortable. Where the fuck are they? Return to the city and prepare them for travel. All that remains. <gasps> oh, Kiki! Wow, Kiki. You're really jealous. Faking his death? Excellent work, my oh my god, that's your pet! Find the rest of him and have yourself a nice little snack. Kiki! Okay, so we're gonna see his face now. Don't worry, I won't leave him. Lose, you're so sweet. Ooh. Ooh. This is the golden guard? Yeah, he's got a rough luck looking mug. Wake up. <laughs> <laughs> I really thought I was really concerned. I was like, oh god, please no, don't don't catch the fields. You just <laughs> Next week. 
Oh, here come the dragon. Why does it have to be made of hands? Okay, so does it think it ate all the golden guard and now it'll leave him alone? So this, I'm guessing this is off the boiling aisles. Hey man, I just saved your life. The least you can do is tell me your name. Mm, or recall your parents. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Oh boy. Oh damn, loose! Fucking parkour skills are on point. Woo, damn, loose! Levitation spells. Oh no. Are you powerless without this? That's a yes. You gonna blast me to bits? <laughs> nah, you're too nice for that. Fly away? You think I'll just let you walk away with them? Maybe you won't have a choice. I'm more formidable than you think. <laughs> 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 Loose. He's like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> Loose. Oh, you're so delightful. I love you. Oh, this is. Oh my god. What made you want to join? Family. You were right before. I'm a powerless witch. A lot of my ancestors were. I never thought I'd have a future in a world like this. But then Bellows found me and gave me a staff with artificial magic. Said the Titan had big plans for them. Oh, so you're adopted. At least you have your future figured out now. At least you can figure out your own. Does he seem dangerous to you? Oh, she's opening his eyes. That's what the masks was for. This is so cool. Hello, oh. Make sure you share. Now stay in oh. here, okay? We'll get you home safe. Loose, you're gonna need that! <laughs> right. I thought you might have been a good guy. I guess that was just wishful thinking. My name is Hunter. Hunter? <laughs> oh no, Kiki! Lewis, please get your cape back. Oh, damn. Lewis, you're just gonna leave him? Well, I suppose, I'm supposed he can get out of there with uh, his staff. You found someone after all this time. Oh. Go then. Except me, Mom. Maybe I wasn't meant to be here. Could have used the door. <laughs> uh, how thoughtful? It's Palace Wood, you ding dong. The Bonesboro Garden Club was robbed by us. <laughs> Whenever you know what you want, we'll start carving. Ina, you're the best. It's hard to picture my future without seeing my mom. Yeah, there's no rush. Just know that whatever you need from us, we got gotcha. you. They're so cute. Thanks, I get for taking you in. Of course not. I want to help. You told me how wild magic did this to you. I might be able to find a- Oh, he's abusive. I spoke out of turn. It won't happen again. These outbursts are painful. And so is watching you fail. I know you can do better, Hunter. That was just a dick. Luckily, some travelers picked me up out of the wreckage. So, I'm actually doing great. Looks like you had a rough night, though. <laughs> <gasps> the Cardinal chose him? I was not expecting that. Doesn't he already have one? What the fuck is happening? Luz was gonna get her own palace, man. <laughs> I thought the cardinal oh, chose her, and I feel bad for Luz because nothing chose her. But I mean, I'm happy she'll get to ch make her own palace, man. <laughs> I really thought the cardinal was gonna be hers, though. Oh. But I mean, it's it's kind it's a, it's kind of fitting because Hunter has the scar, and the cardinal has the scar on his eye. I don't know. Oh my god, that was spots are taken. That episode was fucking wild. <laughs> So much happened. It went by so quick, but like so much happened that it felt like it was I like fast forward through an hour. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. So, Luce hasn't gotten anything from the Echo Mouse yet. Anything other than what happened with Amity the night before. Everyone at Hexide except Luz got a palisman. Usually they carve their own, but since Bellos has been harvesting the wood for the palismans he's been consuming, they had to do different means, which 
I'm I'm thankful for because like adoption is like the best way to go. Like whether it's talismans or like in the real world world pets, adoption is always the best thing to do because you're saving an animal that does, hasn't had the best life and you get to change its life and it changes yours. We rescued Jackson and we rescued Marcy and my, my sister rescued her cat Zoe. So we got three rescue. Oh, and we rescued Maddie, but she passed away. So we have four rescues that we, we've rescued four, two dogs, two cats. <laughs> okay. So back to the palisman thing. I still can't get, I really thought that Cardinal was going to be Luz's palisman. I really did. I was, about, I was about to say, she doesn't even need the wood. The Cardinal chose her, but nope. It was foolish for me to get my hopes up. I should know better with this show. Never get your hopes up. <laughs> it was bothering her that none of the palismen shows her. So, and she didn't really know what she wanted to do. So she went back to Hexide and was trying to figure out her life. And the Golden Guard came. She yeeted him off his own ship, <laughs> but he got himself back with his staff. That's the thing. Doesn't he already have a staff? Oh, no, wait, but it doesn't have a palisman. But how does it get its power? If it doesn't have a palisman, is that possible? I don't know. I'm not very good at this theorizing shit. <laughs> oh, and then the, the dragon Kiki Mora sends, crashes the ship. Then Luz finds out Kiki sent the dragon and Kiki's trying to kill the Golden Guard and tries to convince the Golden Guard that that's happening, but he doesn't believe her. They go on a long adventure where they're acquaintances. I wouldn't say they're necessarily friends at this point, but... Like, they've saved each other. Luz saved him by not letting him get eaten by the freaking dragon and trying to warn him and just being a nice person where she could have just left him to die in whatever weird forest they were in when they crashed. And the Golden Guard saved her from Kikimura. Luz got to escape because of it. That was quick thinking on Luz's part, though. Stealing that whistle and using the dragon to carry the palismans back. So, like, the whistle controls the dragon. It wasn't actually, like, Kikimura's pet. I thought it was, like, her pet, like, where it was, like, loyal to her because it was a pet. But that's not the case. Apparently, it's just loyal to whoever holds the whistle or... I, whatever, I guess. But that, that wood looked funny. It was like a blue tint. I liked it. It, it reminded me of, oh, what's that type of wood in Minecraft in the freaking nether? The blue wood. It reminded me of that almost. I'm wondering what Luz is going to make her palisman. I feel like a bird would be very fitting because like I've said, I forget which other video it was, but like all the cloth horns have bird related palismans. Ida's got Albert the owl. I don't know the name of Lilith's, but uh, Lilith's got the raven and... Gwen has the eagle, her hawk. I think it's eagle. Like, I feel like Luz is pretty much like Ida's adopted daughter at this point. <laughs> so like, I feel like a bird would make sense. But like, I don't know. Luz's personality, I'm not really good with like connecting like personalities to animals. Luz kind of reminds me of a dog because she's like super friendly. She wants to be around people. She's super social. So I, I'll, I, I'm interested to see what... Luz will choose for her palisman. Also, what is Amity gonna have for a palisman? Cause she missed that day. That just occurred to me. Is it, I swear to God, if Amity doesn't get a palisman, <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Oh, my poor baby. She, oh, she was. Oh my God. All that just came crashing back. That Amity skipped school. <laughs> Cause she was afraid to face Luz. Oh God. I still can't believe they changed the intro, though. Like, they changed it to her new hair. That was... Oh, I was not ready for that. They kind of acknowledged what happened last episode, though. And it's kind of... It doesn't ignore everything that happened. It acknowledges what happened last episode. Not necessarily going into it, because, like, there wasn't really a way for them to go into it other than the way that they did, because Amity wasn't at school. Episodes with the, with the bard coming head, right? So, if he's working with Bellos... That's probably not going to be good. But a lot of people say that's like Ida's ex or like an ex love interest, uh, something like that. Um, I hope he's a good guy because Ida needs to be happy. <laughs> I'm not saying Ida needs anyone to be happy. Ida is fine with herself. I feel like Ida could use some company, especially if Luz, God forbid, Luz leaves the Boing Lyles, which I really hope she doesn't. But if she goes to Connecticut, she can come visit me. She can room with me. We can just vibe. We can be nerdy i'll be a gay disaster she'll be a bisexual disaster we can we can do that together <laughs> i still can't believe she's from connecticut out of all of the countries all of the states connecticut i can't wait to tell my mom she's not gonna care about it. <laughs> i'm gonna go share the news with my mom that loses from connecticut she's probably not gonna care but 
Maybe she will. Mom, so I just, I just finished watching the episode, right? Guess where the main character's from? Connecticut. I was not ready. I literally screamed. <laughs> oh, God. I had to share it. I had to share the news. <laughs> All right, I'll let you go back to bed. You're welcome. Oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's it for this uh, episode. I think I went over everything. I probably missed things. Like, like I said, like, my mind is a messed up place. It's like that episode of Spongebob where all the Spongebobs are in his brain and they're all doing the filing cabinet and then all of a sudden everything's on fire. That's that's what it's like in my head all the time. Yeah, like, did I miss anything? Like, if I missed anything, please let me know. I really appreciate when you guys point things out to me that I miss. Like, I didn't notice in the last episode that Luz is staring at Amity's lips when they, like, cut back from, like, the clo- Oh, God. I, I'm, I'm out of breath. I don't know if it's from going up and down the stairs or from just the Lumity thoughts. <laughs> I'm such a gay disaster. But yeah, let me know if I missed anything. Um, I might have. I'm not really sure. I think that's it. I'm going to go edit this video now. I'm going to try and have it out for 1030, but we'll see because it's almost 7. Also, big thanks to those of you that have gone out of your way to comment nice things, reach out to me on social media. A lot of you have been reaching out on social media lately. Thank you guys so much for that. It sometimes takes me a while to respond. One, because I have a lot of messages and I'm also antisocial as fuck. Um, so I have to be in a social mood to respond. Usually if it's like w one message, I'll respond quickly. But after that, it might, it might take me a while. So bear with me. I swear to God, I'm not ignoring you. I'm not ignoring any of you. I'm just very antisocial and I have to be in the mood to socialize. <laughs> yeah, thanks for all your support, guys. You guys are honestly the best. I don't know what I did to deserve you guys, but I love you guys. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Oops.